I tell you, it's, as you drive or as I'm driving, I can't help but think of the history of this vehicle, where it's been, and that it's gotten out of it and back, and it's in this condition still. <laughs> Absolutely unbelievable. You know, when I drive it around, I go to traffic lights and stuff like that. I always get thumbs up and people want to take pictures of it all the time. Oh, I'm sure. I know. It, it, it does bring back a flood of memories of my former days with Camel Trophy and having qualified um, as one of the top 10 for the 93 Saba Malaysia trip. I had uh, originally done some marketing for for Campbell Trophy, which is how I got introduced to it, working with R.J. Reynolds to back Winter National, back at Winston-Salem. This is a lifetime ago. And I couldn't submit or couldn't qualify because of the work I was doing. And years later, I did submit. And having gotten to know Tom Collins, you know, he was telling me that, well, you know, we, we look each year for certain skills of the people we are wanting to try out and because I didn't really have a lot of mechanical background experience but I was a very strong athlete uh, it was the 93 that I got selected and unfortunately as life would have it I had to take an opportunity with a in a career path that prevented me from the camel trophy so seeing this literally just was a watershed of memories coming back and now to be able to drive it I can tell you whoever is lucky enough to buy this is it, it, it's just a major score whether so. whether you have a history with Campbell Trophy or not I mean this is the quintessential piece of history it's, it's amazing well, I appreciate you saying that thank you